Ladies and gentlemen, we come now to three rounds in the Cage Warriors middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, John, Johnny Jitsu Redmond. We've got a middleweight contest next on the deck and Ian making his way to the cage. A man who's built a reputation of one of the biggest characters, certainly, on the UK and Irish domestic circuit, John, Johnny Jitsu Redmond. Yeah, uh, John Redmond fought some incredibly tough opposition early on in his career, if not throughout his career. Never won to shy away um, from big fights, fighting former Cage Warriors champion Chris Fields uh, many years ago. He travels to London. Um, Look at him, yeah, he's had a, uh, a few unfortunate results. But uh, so he's very, very keen. Now he's moved back up to middleweight. Looks much better for it. And uh, he's now going to have to, uh, you know, just show a, a young gun just how, what, what happens uh, inside the Cage Warriors cage. Well, it's incredible to think of John Redmond as a welterweight. He's got such a big frame, even for 185 pounds. And Ian, as you said, you know, he's fought some incredibly tough guys. He's got five wins against 11 losses, but that's not necessarily a true reflection of this man's skill and ability, and it's certainly no reflection of his heart. Johnny Jitsu is packed full of the right stuff. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing his opponent fighting out of the red corner, Modestus Bukowskis. Now making his way to the cage, our second fighter for this middleweight bout, Mod Modestus Bukowskis. Ian, what do we know about this Lithuanian gentleman living here in England right now? Well, we know he is coming off of a loss, but what, you know, tied by some as a prospect here on the London scene, an exciting fighter, one who's gone abroad as well to the States to learn his trade. And he's very, very keen to make an impression here on Cage Warriors. And this is going to be an interesting fight. You've got a young gun looking to make an impression against an experienced veteran of Redmond who's been there and done it. And maybe, is this going to be the right kind of fight for Bukowskis? Especially after coming off a, a very quick loss last time out against a very high level guy. Now he's fighting a veteran who's not going to have any fear against an exciting young gun. And we saw in the corner there the very experienced Dennis and Sutherland, uh, himself a veteran of Cage Warriors and pretty much every promotion here in the UK scene and, and beyond. Dennison taking a lot of experience into the corner of Modestus Bukowskis for this one. Yeah, you know, having somebody like Sutherland in your corner is definitely going to help. And uh, a striker like Bukowskis, that must be uh, definitely some wars in training. So once again, ladies and gentlemen, three rounds in the Cage Warriors middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a mixed martial artist. He holds a professional record of five wins, 11 losses. Standing six feet, four inches tall, he weighed in at 185 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, John, Johnny Jitsu Redman. And introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of four wins, one loss. Standing six feet three inches tall, he weighed in at 185 pounds from Lithuania, fighting out of London, England, Modestus Bukowskis. And when the action begins, the referee in charge, Mr. Rich Mitchell. No nonsense, Rich Mitchell about to get this one underway. Three five-minute rounds if they need them in the Cage Warriors middleweight divi division. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Puskauskas in the yellow, Johnny Jitsu in the black and green trim. It's going to be interesting to see what happens right now, Brad. Redmond likes the war. Bukowskis definitely looks like he's going to bring it as well. Nice start. Just feel himself out. Ends with a strike. It'd be interesting to see if both people are going to down, if both fighters are going to buy on stand and trade. Yeah, both guys, you know, just feeling each other out here. You know, staying on the outside, coming in for you know clicks, then exchanges like that. Now, you know, it's just starting to get heated up. Redmond's definitely going to have no fear in this position, but Bukowskis, um before has definitely showed like uh, a good grappling game as well as um, striking. Oh, oh, oh. Some nice knees there from Redmond in close. 
I think, as you said, Revan's been in some wars. He seems to thrive off it, but it has stop, cost right? him in the past. Time, time, time. And we've seen Aaron Nee there. Over there. Over there. Just over didn't target that one correctly. Surely no venom behind that one, but... I'm good, I'm good. No, no venom. I mean, no, you know, John Listen Redden, to me. Right. That a, was actually the second one you got yeah. him with. The first one was in the hole. So that's two in a row, right? Character. Lose the position. Um, right. He's on business right. when he Go. goes into the cage. But that was definitely an accident. Spinning back kick from Redman and another one across the body. Oh, a huge spinning back kick from Bukaskis there. Really heard the crack on that one here in the Camden Centre. Redman knows better than that. He's trying to entertain the crowd, but look what happens. It is flashing oh, back. Oh, Johnny Jitsu standing in for the finish. And it's all over. He stands as his man. Johnny Jitsu. Wait, don't, don't stay there for me. Wow. Proving why that cliche is absolutely 100% correct. Phenomenal stuff from the Irishman taking this fight on just a few days' notice. And we said that he likes to get into a war, and sometimes it's cost him tonight. It paid dividends. A huge win. I mean, let's take a look back in at some of the action. We'll see the finish here. Big right hands bombing down. Wow, Redmond just... Stunning, stunning finish right there. And you see how much it meant to him. But this is risky, though. But then look at it. Bang. That, that was a huge straight right. Straight down the middle. Bang. Crisp and clean as you like. John Redman with a huge knockout victory knockout here back. at Cage Warriors. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Rich Mitchell has called a stop to this contest at one minute and 12 seconds of the very first round, declaring the winner by knockout, John Johnny Jitsu Redman. We're here with Johnny Redman. It's interview time, Johnny. I, I can see how much that meant to you. Just talk us through it. Well, as everybody knows me, uh, I fought with Cage Warriors before. Uh, I fought a lot of good fights. I, I fought in here with a broken foot before. I fought in Jordan, got cut open. I think it was one of the bloodiest battles ever. When the show left, a bit of me left. I'm back now. I'm fucking hungry. I love this show. Yeah, no, it was, a, it was an exciting matchup. You know, you weren't afraid to stand there and trade with him. You know, you were looking for opportunities, throwing, spinning stuff, and then finally you connected and took your opportunity. Listen, Modestus is a fantastic fighter. I felt his power there. But there's no two ways about it. I wasn't coming here to fucking just be part of this. So I was coming here like to fucking win this fight. And I knew I had the power here. I've been working on me boxing with Jimmy Gillen. I knew me clinch was strong. I knew I could win this fight. I wasn't coming here to play around. Yeah, no, definitely. I think, you know, a lot of people said coming in this that they shouldn't take your record as a, as a reflection oh. of, of where you're at. And I think you showed that tonight with a tremendous performance. Like what I always said, and this never aired in an interview before, records are for fucking DJs. I'm fucking for real. Yeah, no, definitely. I think you're not afraid to fight anyone. And, and, oh. and, that, and that showed. And, and, you know, big, big props to you and a tremendous event. Thank you very much. Uh, just like to say a big thank you to Ian Dean and Graham Boylan for having me back. As I said, this is my home and I feel at home in this cage. Th this is where I belong. Yeah, after performances like that, we look forward to having you again. Johnny Redman, everyone. Who's the fuck?